everybody. Today what we're going to do is we're going to make something special for our Passover holiday. One of the things that happens during Passover is there's a tradition of hiding the afikomen. Afikomen is a piece of matzah that we have. It's a big piece of matzah and what happens is we cut it in half and one half goes into our matzah bag and the other half goes into an afikomen bag. So that's what we're gonna learn how to make today. In my house, what we do is the children hide the afikomen and at the end of the ceremony, at the end of the Seder, the grown-ups can't finish until they have the afikomen. So we have to search for the afikomen and the child that finds it usually gets a prize. But in my house, everybody gets a prize. In some families, the grown-ups hide the afikomen and the children have to find it. In other families, the children hide the afikomen and the adults have to find it. But meanwhile, the afikomen, the piece of matzah, has to go in something. So today, I'm gonna to show you two quick things that we can do. I'm, I know that napkins are a prized possession now with um, our paper shortage, but we can use this one today. So I'm just unfolding it. Please put some newspaper down on your table so you don't make too much of a mess. And then I have these, um, I guess they're called bingo dots, um, but you can use crayons, you can use markers, you can use anything. And we're just gonna make a design. So I'm using lots of spring colors because Passover comes in the spring and we're celebrating new beginnings. So I decided to use green, blue, and purple. So obviously the children can do whatever they want with this. And then if you have, excuse me, I'm sorry. If you have a paper bag at home, just a little lunch bag, um, then the children with your help can just glue the napkin right on the bag. Now I was being very Martha Stewart this morning and I made one already. So it's ready to go. Put your matzah, put your matzah right in the bag, fold it up and then go hide it somewhere. You could do that even today if you want to. Our children can hide it and the grown-ups can go find it or vice versa. If you don't have a bag, another thing that works really great and is really easy is just an envelope, okay? So again, I wrote Afi Komen on this one, but again, you can do anything with this. I really do love the dots because it's super clean. You know, just decorating. If the children write all over the name, Afi Komen, it doesn't matter. It's just the fun of doing the art project together. And I'm going to use the blue too, just to make it gorgeous. And simple enough. I'm going to open it up, put the Afi Komen right inside. And then again, hide it, and you all are in business. The afikomen means the dessert, the dessert after the Seder. So remember, you can't finish the Seder until you find the afikomen. All right, my friends, I'll see y'all soon.